right, we're at our, uh, we at our second box of Tokyo Revengers. We went through the first box. Um, special rares are, there's only seven of them. Super special rares. Those are typically signed. They do have a new card that I'm not familiar with. This is the TRV, the Tokyo Revenger rare. Haven't seen any of those. Got the triple rare and a super rare. We did pull a super rare in the last one, which is fairly common in in most of the boxes. Like you usually get a super rare or a triple rare or some some hit like that. You usually get one, at least one or two hits per box. Um, so we did get a super rare last time. Um, a couple, maybe we only get one hit per box, but all right. Our PR is uh, Mitsuya. Um, last one we got Baji. So we'll uh, start with the right side this time. And uh, I open from the back. Um, so yeah, I've been playing uh, this game and Flesh and Blood as my low, uh, my current TCGs as of late. And uh, I really appreciate those games. Those games are pretty good. Um, I'm gonna try to go a little bit quicker than I did last time. Um, we got ourselves another Mitsuya. So we're pulling the Mitsuyas this time. I'll move these. I'll keep the rares off to, off to the front so we can kind of keep track of like what our, uh, what our full rate is. So we'll keep the regular rares and the double rares um, off to the side. So the double rare slot is right here. And we got ourselves a Hina double rare. And then our normal rare is a Mikey Kids Meal with a Climax card. Um, and I guess you can get Climax rares and stuff in addition. So you can have, um, you can have multiple hits. You can have, I think, up to three hits per pack. In the climax rare, a double rare, and like then the rare section. So, so it looks like we got another double rare with a Katsuhori and then a founding member Mikey rare with a my hero climax. Oh, stay in the, stay in the right lane. So the right lane seems where all the hits are, all the double. Double rares are in the right side. Remember that. <laughs> yeah. If you want to open packs at your... Oh, look at that. We got ourselves another triple rare Climax card. It's unfortunate that we keep getting the triple rare Climaxes. I was hoping for like triple rare non-Climax cards, but these are pretty cool. I think this is the one... We... No, we got a different one last time. Um, the foiling is different on this particular climax card than the last one um, but it's pretty cool it's a draken so the draken's my favorite character in the show uh, and then we got ourselves a draken and mikey regular rare so it does appear that the right side is where the hits are so far we've pulled our we've pulled two double rares and a triple rare from the right um, finally no no mega rare in there, but we got ourselves a Draken and Mikey rare. Um, I don't know if anybody else out there opened packs of cards. I do. I started opening packs of cards on video because I was told if you do it just in case something bad happens or something very special happens. Um, having video evidence of a bad thing is good and um, good things are nice to share. So ever since then, I have just actually just decided I was pretty much open everything on camera because otherwise, if something really cool happens, oh, look at that, we got something special again, and it is going to be a super rare Baji. I think this is the super rare we got last time. Looks like that's our hits for the box, which is whatever, um, not bad. Then we got Baji again with the same piece of art, which I think is actually interesting. It's the cover art, I believe. Um, they just cut out, uh, oh, what's his name? I forget, I don't know his name actually. I haven't got that far into the <laughs> anime yet. So it looks like we got a super rare and a triple rare, which means this particular box is probably spent. 
Um, and no surprise, we're gonna open up the rest of the box because I'm not, I'm not one to. Um, and then there's that Climax Rare that we hit earlier uh, as a triple. I'm not one to open packs and then sell off the dead packs at a premium. That's, I think, kind of a jerk move. We did get another double rare. Um, so, in my opinion, the the right side specialty is where all the action is. We will now do the left side to see if we get nothing. If we get nothing on the left side, that'll be really kind of crappy. That'd be nothing so far. And a regular rare Commander Mikey. Commander Mikey's a good card. He's got that combo or uh, battle on it. He's got the backup on it. I mean, sorry, backup is what they call it. I forget what they always call that thing. So, another. Oh, we just got another one of these. Uh, Baji and Katori. That's, a, that's two of those. Should have a place of those now. I think with the, um, I know there's not a lot of financial value. Oh, all right, we do get a double rare with our Mitsuya. Um, not a lot of value. Oh, there's a Tamagotchi or Tamachi in uh, as an adult or whatever you would want to call them. Um, there's not a lot of financial in the Bushy Road products other than the very, very high end cards, the super rares. Or the special rares, super special rares. These sign stamped ones are usually, they go for quite a few dollars if you can find a buyer. All right, we got ourselves a rare Draken, changing the tides of the battle. And then last three packs. Um, yeah, the, uh, we got ourselves a Katori and Mikey card. Oh, we got ourselves a Climax Rare. I think we've seen this one before. No, a new era of delinquents, and then a regular climax common. Um, yeah, so the climax cards do come in rare too. You should get one or two of those per pack or per box, um, and they could be good. We did pull another double rare with uh, a Mikey and Draken. Did I put those cards there? Those should not go there. Those are not considered. I've been putting the wrong cards there. Only double rares. Um, and then we got ourselves a single rare. Can't hit Kafuyu. And the last pack, hopefully it's not, hopefully we get super lucky and we get another triple rare or something. A TBR would be cool, but I don't suspect we'd get anything too crazy. It doesn't look like it. We got ourselves a nice um, Hina and Tam Tamaga. Tama, Tama, I forget. Uh, single rare. So, um, so our hits out of this box, we did ourselves a double rare, another double rare, double rare, SR, a triple rare, a double rare. So it was at five double rares, an SR, and a triple rare climax. Uh, not too bad. Not the most expensive box, but these these boxes are going for roughly 50 bucks. So if you can find them for 50 or 60 dollars, I think you're doing pretty good. And um, the set's really good. It's really playable, and uh, they're fairly new enough. So I think you can, if they aren't gonna beat the current meta, they're new enough where you could probably win up quite a few games at your local scene because the cards are new enough and surprising enough. So. Give it a try. Go to your local local play and play the game. Pick up a trial deck. Um, until next time, peace.